I think lots of modern women actors have found it really extraordinary and sometimes unbelievable to think that Shakespeare wrote his female roles for male actors. Janet Sussman has been absolutely kind of scornful in a way about this, about Cleopatra, and Cleopatra does seem uh, a real challenge uh, for a young, uh, a young male actor to take on, particularly when Cleopatra herself draws attention to the squeaking uh, Cleopatra boy my greatness at the end so, so she plays with this moment that really uh, this is a male actor um, parodying her femininity perhaps. Uh, I think Shakespeare's women characters have been a fascinating source of uh, discussion since the 17th century uh, and the question of how uh, progressive or how recognisable they are uh, continues, continues to rumble on. Um, I've been thinking quite a lot just recently about Twelfth Night and I am really interested in uh, a sort of double-hander of Olivia uh, and Viola Cesario and how we might think about uh, quite different models of femininity that may maybe seem quite apposite for the 21st century, uh, a, a range, uh, certainly a kind of non-binary range in which maybe that old question about Shakespeare's women uh, gets a little bit more nuanced uh, with, uh, or a broader definition of what of what that means, what woman means.